Hello again, everyone, and welcome back to The Witcher 3. We are back here in uh, the Bloody Baron's um, little hide hideout here. Apologies for the lack of videos recently. I have been nursing a bit of an illness, which is still lingering, but I'm hoping to fight through it for some good old Witcher content. Um, so, we, w we were at these two uh, merchants, weren't we? We were at the regular merchant, the Quartermaster. Um... I think we may have already looked at what he was offering. I think we may have actually bought bought it already. Um, yeah, I don't think we need we need we need another decoy card. I could be wrong, but uh, I think we already got the Nilf Guardian stuff as well, did we? Maybe. I, I I'm not even fully certain. To be fair, uh, did we sell all the arm which we don't need? I don't know if selling it to this guy... No, selling to this guy is probably not the best idea. We'll sell it to the blacksmith slash um, armor smith, whatever he is. Uh, let's play Gwent. Playing Gwent's always a good I'll idea, I think. A few rounds of Gwent. What are we Gwenting? Uh, so I think we have our usual sets here. Um, do we need to... Uh, trying to decide whether I'm actually happy with this or not. Like, I could potentially sac sacrifice... No, the Kudwani Siege, Siege, Siege Expert is actually quite useful. Uh, I'll start it. I'll go with that. I'm not gonna... I'm, not, I'm trying not to overcomplicate things. This guy's just a Northern, regular Northern Realms guy with a standard fault test, so he can... I can't remember what he can do. Oh, he can play a clear weather card at any point, can't he? Right, okay. Right, what do we have? Uh, clear weather and torrential rain... Probably not going to want Torrential Rain, but, uh... Commander's Horn's good. Death Mold, Trebuchet, Ballista. I'll swap out my Torrential Rain card. I got another Catapult. That is excellent. Right, I'm going to settle on that. Thank you. As per usual, we'll play somewhat cautious. Um... I can't remember if that only worked when the cards played or not. I'm not sure. Uh, I'll just play a, 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 a him first, the Blue Stripes Commando. Kira Metz, okay, fair enough. Uh, we will just play a Kidwani Siege Expert. He also has a Kitamai Siege Expert, fair enough. Uh, we'll play Zoltan. Um, okay, I'll pass. I'll pass for now. Right, what else have we got? So he's obviously got an extra card now, which is not ideal. Dump Venom. Ah, shit. That's a very, that's a very good card to play, actually. Um, right, well, we're going to have to pull, pull out the big guns, aren't we? Catapult. Passed, okay. Um... So if we play our weakest card, which is, yeah, to be fair, oh, mm, yeah, we'll just play that and we'll pass. We've still got a few things up our sleeve, it's not ideal, but uh, we've got the Commander's Home, we've got Falter Siege Master, we've got a Yarp and Zigrin, who's a bit of a fodder card to be honest, but we'll, we'll, we'll deal with it. Yeah, we'll just play him first. Ballista, okay, fair enough. Uh, we'll play Death Mold. Trebuchet, okay. I will also play a Trebuchet. Shit. Well, well, okay, but what if I negate that? Didn't see that one coming, did you? 
Sheldon Skaggs. Okay. Then we've got the old uh, Ballista. Okay. I mean, I'm still winning, even with that, so that's fine. Let's double... Let, let's double Death Mold. Okay. And let's just max it out if possible. We'll uh, play Fault Test Ability as well. And we, we can't do anything else, so... He shouldn't be able to win now, though. No, he definitely cannot fucking win. Not a chance. Wonderful! <coughs> so we win that pretty comfortably in the end. We got 20 crowns and... Philippa Eilhart! Ooh, ooh. That, that's bound to be a good card, isn't it? Oh, it's a hero card, yes! A, a, ten, a 10 strength hero card, nice. So we will, uh, what do we want to remove? If we remove, if we remove Sheldon, because we are quite heavily Oh, do we, uh, yeah, no, let, let's just remove Yarpen. Move Yarpen and we'll put in uh, Philippa. She is a beast. Okay, wonderful. Uh, now, Fergus Graham. Who may I assist you? Who may I assist you? Master Armor. Looking for someone who can craft me some armor. Gotta be top quality. Well, I've been out of 20 years now. Master the craft in some respects, if I do say so myself. <laughs> you wish. Ha! <laughs> Don't listen to her. She's been sore lately, snorting every chance she gets. So, what kind of armor are we talking about? Light, but durable. Can't constrain movement, and I gotta be able to get in it without anybody's help. Vital. That all? Sure it shouldn't be self-cleaning. And how about it wipe your arse after you take a shite in the bushes? <laughs> Could it? <laughs> strong and light will do just fine. Comfortable, strong and light will do just fine. Ought to know one thing when it comes to armor. If it's got to be durable, it can't be light. It can. Just needs the proper tools to make it. Tools like the folk of Clan Tordoroch use on Undvik. Joanna, I told you time and again to stay silent when I talk to customers. Shouldn't pest our folk with those nonsense Skellige legends of yours. It ain't legend. And it ain't nonsense. My granddad would go to Unvik for his armor. Said Tordoroch folk made the best. Till last year, that is, when a giant ravaged their island. Inhabitants either ran off or died, but the forge should still be in one piece. Interesting. Worth looking into. Say I find the tools. Will you craft the armor for me? <clears throat> On condition you bring the tools. But only then. Okay, know where the forge is. These legends mention where the forge might be. Yes, north side of the isle, in a cave. Clan folk carved out a rock face to build it. So that's for when we go to Skelliger at some point. Cool. Next time I'm in Skelliger. <coughs> care now. Okay, master armors. Must be a secondary quest, is it? That's level twenty-four, so it's gonna be a while. Perhaps from to forge top notch equipment for our hero, but first he needs the appropriate tools. Geralt does set out in search for them. How can I help you? Oh, this this is another person. It's his wife who just informed us. It's another end interactable merchant, apparently. Interesting lilt in your voice. You were originally from Skellige? Oh, I'm Skellig. Spent my whole childhood in Holmstein. Why'd you leave? Always had a liking for the smithy. I'd sit there so is Skellige basically the Midlands? The heat of the furnace, the smell of the hot steel, the pounding hammers. At 17 winters, my dad told me he could teach me no more. Sent me out there into the world, bid me to hone my craft. A few years on, I had my master crafting papers. Then the war broke out and I landed here. <coughs> Interesting. What haven't stock? What are you selling? What's good? Um... So master armor, so I should be able to sell most of my lesser used armors here. 
like so. Uh, can I buy anything? Level 10, level 10. See, I'm not a million miles away most of it, is the, for most of it is the thing. Got some nice cavalry trousers and some uh, tracker's boots there, which I can maybe buy if I wanted to. Everything else is a bit... Uh, not really much use for me, I don't think. Uh, I'll buy them. Why not? I'll buy them and I'll slap them on. Take care. Now. Let me just uh, check that. Yep, and the trousers. Lovely. There's a slot in my boots as well to put something in. Add sign. That will do. How can I help you? And I'll sell whatever I was just wearing then. There we go. Uh, I'll sell what one of my... Uh, I'll sell both my axe glyphs. I don't use it very often, to be fair. Right. Uh, so, Gwent. Let's play Gwent with old... Uh, a few rounds of Gwent. Joanne here, was it? Which called Joanne? I don't know if this is a different sort of person than... The actual blacksmith himself, in terms of the stock and the playing Gwent, but uh, we'll, we'll we'll find out. Uh, right, we'll start the game with that because we do have Philip in, in the deck, don't we? Of course we do. Banging. Hopefully we get her on this draw. Oh, this person's using monsters. Okay, so we don't have Philip in our deck at the moment. We have two commanders' horns. Clear weather torrential. We got a lot of weather and buff cards, not a lot of actual unit cards. So I could probably sort that one out. Uh, we don't. We, mm, we'll get rid of the torrential rain cards. Trebuchet, nice. And. Impenetrable fog. Uh, we have a few range cards, so. I got another one. That's fine. That works. That works out for me. So like I say, we don't we don't have a Philippa, which is not ideal, but we could still draw her if we uh, if we win a, if if we're around. What is that? What's oh, an Earth Elemental? Okay, fair enough. Uh, this. A Frightener. Interesting. Um, I'm just going to play the Kudweni Siege Expert and see what she does now. Okay. So that's, that's, his, that's her special ability used. So I'm going to pass on that now. That's fine. Oh, but one of their things remains on the uh, on the field now, don't they? Now oh, is that the uh, siege one? Okay, fair enough. Pass it straight away. That's fine. Problem is now I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna have to play two cards, otherwise I can't win. So I think the best thing I can do is to play Kira, and then just use a use a commander's horn and I think. That, would that be the best thing to do? Yeah, I think so. Good stuff. So we'll draw a card. They still have the fucking siege weapon on, on the field. Oh, fuck me. Really? Ah, uh, son of a bitch. Okay, fine. We're just going to have to go, go for it, I suppose. Not much else we can really do right now. Oh my god, what the fuck? Find any cards with the same name in your deck and play them immediate play them instantly. Oh, it's all the crones. Oh, that's awful. Okay, fair enough. We might still be able to win. Maybe. It's unlikely, but maybe. You fucking wanker. Oh, actually no no wait, no wait. We we are prepared for this. We we, we are prepared for this eventuality. Please don't say there's more of those. Uh, 
Okay. Not gonna lie, this might be tricky. What the fuck is is this deck? Genuinely, what the fuck is that is this? Oh my god, I've never seen anything like this before. I've been- I've been absolutely destro- Oh my god, there's a fucking special hero card as well! What the hell am I looking at here? Oh my god! What the fuck? How can I help you? What kind of fucking deck have you got? Up for a few re My god, I've never I've never seen anything like it. Genuinely never seen anything like it. Start the game again just like that. Hopefully we get a bit of a better draw this time, but I can't believe that. Honestly, I can't, can't fucking believe that that, that that was actually a thing. Um. Uh. D -d 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 -d. Let's get rid of the siege one. Okay, it's not ideal. But we'll go with that. I'm still flabbergasted by that by that whole thing, not gonna lie. Like genuinely I'm pretty I'm pretty fucking stunned. Ice giants, okay, nice. Um Fair enough. This is not going well, is it? Let's be honest, I'm gonna pass. Oh dear me, I am... See, the fact that they always keep one on the board as well as a fucking... Oh, what, really? Oh. God damn it. Oh no. Oh. Honestly, this is this is just so fucking tragic. Oh god, it gets worse. Uh <laughs> I'm gonna have I'm gonna have to play my um this card, aren't I? Yeah, I have to. But now Fall Test's ability is useless, unless I can get a Siege ability here, Siege card here. That might actually be somewhat good, to be fair. That might be good. Somewhat. Like so. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Honestly, what the fuck? Hang fire though, hang fire. Okay, fair enough. So now we basically have to just double our double our siege 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 units and hope that he can't make that up within four cards, which he probably will be. She, we, uh, oh. Great. That's that's really helpful. Thanks for that. No, I, you know, no, no. You know what? No, thanks, thanks. No, seriously, I appreciate it. Thank you for that. Yeah, no, thanks. Honestly, I'm, I mean it. Hundred percent mean it. 
Cheers. Really thank you, honestly. I'm you? so thankful that you did that. Right, I'm going to end this episode here, guys. Next episode, we'll carry on attempting to beat this bitch at Gwent. Um, so, yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you all have enjoyed. If you haven't, please do like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I shall catch you all in the next episode of The Witcher 3. Thanks again, guys. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.